Hi, I'm Bruce from Motorcycle Sport and Leisure magazine and I'm here at Ascari in Spain for the launch of the 2011 Triumph Speed Triple. Um, we're just done a couple of laps around the circuit and uh, straight away it's quite notable how different it is to the current 2010 model. Um, for a start, the new Brembo brakes are uh, extremely effective. Um, fantastic power delivery and uh, confidence inspiring really. You can brake really deep and consistent brakes, that's all good. Um, the frame's all new and um, basically you, you can feel that. They've, they've done a bit of mass centralisation, they've moved weight around on the bike to get more weight over the front end of the bike and uh, consequently the whole machine's a lot more stable and as well as that uh, the front end feels so much more controlled, uh, it feels really planted. Uh, consequently, the, the rear wheel will start to move a bit more on the power, um, but by dropping a bit of rear preload, you can get that to settle down. Um, the power is really impressive. Um, there's nothing necessarily staggering about the engine, but it's so linear that you can use it. Uh, it's very torquey, um, so you know, it makes the, uh, the most of the gearbox as well. You can pretty much chuck any gear at it and it will pull, uh, which is all good. Um, comfort wise, the new seat is a lot bigger, so you can move around on the bike a lot more. The old seat was a bit more containing, so, um, so that's another positive about the machine. Um, but yeah, so um, first impressions are really quite short of the bike. Um, I'm just going to go out and do a few more laps of the circuit and we'll back again soon.